Hello, I'm Greg Wheeler. The Patterns of Thinking Method allow your students to learn content knowledge and thinking skills in parallel. The Patterns of Thinking, or DSRP, can be used with any student in any subject area at any grade level. You can use guiding questions to teach your students to take perspective. From the perspective of blank, what does this idea look like? Can you think about this idea from a different perspective? Perspective, this interplay between point and view, is a universal pattern of thinking. Think blocks are a way to model perspective taking. Your students can use the reflective side of any think block to look at an idea from one or more points of view. Let's say you're studying the Civil War. From the perspective of the North, what were the important issues of the Civil War? Students may respond, preserving the United States or slavery, from the perspective of the South, what were the important issues of the Civil War? Students may say states' rights or rapid economic changes. What other perspectives might be relevant? Can you think about the Civil War from a different perspective? Students may say things like the economy, medicine, or Europe. You can leave these ideas around the think block to represent the different part-whole structures that are a result of taking different perspectives. Or you can keep adding think blocks to show the cumulative effect of taking multiple viewpoints. You can also mix realia with think blocks to look at real-world phenomena from several points of view. Artwork, objects in a science class, books, all of these can be looked at from several viewpoints. Teachers in different disciplines often use perspective circles to model ideas. Students learn that no matter the subject area, they can take several perspectives on any idea. Over time, students learn to look at the world from multiple points of view, that the other patterns of thinking, distinctions, systems, and relationships among ideas change when the perspective changes, and ultimately, students learn pro-social behaviors like empathy and compassion, traits that rely on perspective taking. With the Patterns of Thinking method, your students learn about perspective, the point-view structure that's universal to all ideas. The reflective side of think blocks remind your students that any idea can be a point of view and give your students practice in constructing physical models of perspective taking.